Hiding cool little easter eggs in multiplayer maps is something that isn't done loads by Treyarch but however has been done before and this time in particular easily has the most zombies easter eggs and references in just one map. Usually we've had just the occasional one or two littered around but this time we have quite a few and it's really nice seeing the love for zombies and maybe a few of these easter eggs in particular may be hinting at something later down the line. So without any hesitation, let's go and see what is in store. I am going to start with the biggest one here, the one that is easily the most discussion and is really in the spotlight. And this is, of course, the Der Eisendracher machine. More specifically, this is a pinball machine in an arcade. It looks really damn cool. There's a lot of little details on it and a lot of people seem to be thinking that this is going to be some kind of teaser or something related to DE. I think saying it's going to be back in Cold War is a bit of a stretch and, it, and it's reaching a bit, but I'm not at all being negative about this, nor am I saying this is completely off the table. It could easily happen. I mean, out of all the maps they could have picked, why did they pick Der Eisendracher? It just seems very specific, especially if you take into consideration the next thing I'm going to show you. There is one Der Eisendracher pinball machine that actually has has a comic book that is open on top of it and that comic book the contents inside of it is none other than the Der Eisendracher opening cutscene or at least some of it. That is the one part that really does strike me as odd like they literally have a comic book with the opening cutscene it is getting a bit suspicious now. I mean something must be being teased here but however I'm not going to be acting like they're going to remaster the map as undeniably cool as as that would be, I don't think we will get that. Moving on, we have another pinball machine, and this is a monkey bomb machine. There's nothing really to say about it, it's just a fun little easter egg I'm sure, and I definitely do think this is Treyarch showing off how good their retro art can be, like Dead Ops Arcade. Something else I feel is worth mentioning is the Matroshka dolls that have appeared in not even just this map, but I'm pretty sure they've appeared in a few others in Cold War. The Matroshka dolls, of course, being a cluster grenade wonder weapon type of thing that was introduced in Ascension, and we haven't really had them in many maps, and especially with Russia being a bigger theme in this Cold War zombie story, I think it would be cool to see them again. There's also Bubby from Burger Town. This isn't even his first appearance either. They seem to be bringing him back for loads of little Easter eggs, and I feel like they're going to continue to keep referencing him as some kind kind of ongoing joke. For those who don't know, Bubby is the mascot from Burger Town, which is a map in Advanced Warfare. And I'm gonna be honest, I am all for it. There's a reference to Dead Ops Arcade. We get to see the one and only <laughs> Mama back. Oh, how far Dead Ops Arcade has come. <laughs> There's also Gumball Machines, and these have a very striking resemblance to Dr. Monty's Gobble Gum Machines. And I know pretty much every Gumball Machine looked like this, but it wouldn't surprise surprise me if Gobblegums really did come back. There's also a poster underneath this like radio thing I think it is and it basically has what looks to be the Shrines of Shangri-La. It looks like some kind of postcard with the word Laos on it and a few other words that you can't really make out. But however in red marker there is writing on it that says Naga is fucking crazy. <laughs> Do not cross. Naga if that's how it is pronounced are the dragons that the statues themselves are based off of in Shangri-La. Are these things moving around or something? This one, much like the Der Eisendracher easter egg, is just a very particular and very just suspicious thing in general. Like, there's no other way to put it, it just seems very out there and very cryptic. Makes those two things really seem like something more than just a fun little reference. And last but not least, if you look on the barrel that that thing is sat on, you will notice that it has N6, meaning Nova 6, that has been spray painted on it. Nova 6 is a pretty big thing in zombies and definitely is in this storyline. This is all just more food for thought. I really hope we see at least one of these things adapted and it goes somewhere, but I wouldn't be jumping to conclusions too fast. Anyways, I'm going to leave this video here today. If you enjoyed, be sure to smash the like button 
button. Comment any theories you have about any of these easter eggs down in the comments below. I would love to hear this. And most importantly, subscribe to the channel as well. I've been uploading Cold War Zombies very consistently and you don't want to miss it. So hitting the notification bell too is gonna alert you as soon as I post. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time.